One of the most popular stories on our ClickOrlando.com website right now is about all of the new laws going into effect in Florida on July 1st. And the new law about HOAs. Now that one is generating a lot of interest. If you live in an HOA community, you know how restrictive they can be sometimes. News 6's Laverne McGee is here to tell us why you will soon have some more freedom, Laverne. Thankfully, right? I mean, in some of these communities, you can't even plant your own vegetable garden. You can't even park sometimes your work vehicle in your own driveway. But this new law is going to change that. Uh, it was like a daily issue every time there was something that they had to pick on. Kirsty Pope says she would get notices from her former HOA on just about everything. Some believe HOAs have too much power and not enough accountability. Now, HB 1203, detailed on the Florida Senate website, will try to ensure HOAs will not be able to misuse their authority. Things like how quickly you have to get your garbage cans out of sight. So 24 hours before and 24 hours after the garbage truck comes, as long as you've taken them, them in and during that 48-hour time period, you can't get a violation anymore. Attorney Jennifer Englert says some of her clients have had huge fines for unreasonable issues and time limits, like taking down holiday and Christmas lights. The new law makes it clear. If you just get caught up and you can't get those Christmas lights down, you've got to get some warning. Also, relief for people who have company take-home vehicles with logos, like police and firefighters, who've not been able to park in their own driveways. Work vehicles are able to be parked in your driveway without a violation. When the new HOA laws take effect on July 1st, you're going to be able to pretty much do whatever you want inside your garage and also inside your house. I'm very happy, yes. Laverne McGee, Getting Results, News 6. And this mm -hmm. is one of the most sweeping HOA reform bills, and there is a lot of fine print. Yeah, it impacts so many people. So, Laverne, uh, we know what this new law will mean uh, for homeowners, but what's going to happen to all of those HOA officers whose job it is to enforce all of those rules? Well, they are trying to make stricter penalties. They are making them, actually, so that there are, they can avoid corruption, things like mm. kickbacks. So, you know, when they want everybody to fix their red mailbox mm -hmm. and they're not, you know, maybe getting a yeah. kickback from the paint company. Uh, also, they have to um, ensure that they are enforcing uh, their balance balance sheets, and all, all of their um, financial statements. So, so those, some more oversight. A little more accountability. More yeah. Accountability, and also you need to check with your HOA and make sure that they are, in fact, enforcing these laws and changing the bylaws in your community as well. Yeah, this is going to lead to, I think, a lot of issues because oh. so many people live in a community that is run by an HOA. We had a story the other day, trash cans, $400 fine wow. for leaving them out twice. Mm -hmm. Unbelievable. Wild stuff. <laughs> yeah, Not anymore, though. Hopefully. Yeah, not going to happen anymore. Thank you so much.